Mm -hmm. I'm gonna open Audacity. That's the, just a shortcut to the software. We're gonna, we have a, um, use the eject button. I would just use this one. They have two, but like, so I'm putting tape in. I'm gonna rewind it while I open Audacity and then it's like, oh, okay. I won't open that probably. Yep. Um, usually you want this to say line USB audio codec to two um, stereo channels. Um, usually when I'm record, I might just capture a little bit lower just in case it's a really loud recording because we don't want it to clip. So I'm bringing it down to about 80. This is for recording. It's that little microphone thing there. And see, there's another little microphone thing here. So um, what we have to do is, so it stopped rewinding over here. Um, oh, and just FYI, this is connected via USB. Um, there's a cable that it comes out of the back of the deck. So connect via USB here. Then it, where it says click to start monitoring, I'm gonna click in there and then that goes away. Um, and then I'm gonna, um, gonna press the record button, which just means capture really. Then I press play over here. And then you should start seeing little, yeah, there it is, there it starts. So now it is capturing the audio. You can listen on here to the deck. Um, and then um, also if you wanna hear uh, the pitch here, pitch is actually speed. So he, this it's going really slow and then it's gonna go really fast here. So I like to keep it in the middle because that's normally what it should be, but I like having a little bit of control. I don't know. Most tapes are gonna be the oh. one speed, but. Export, you can export it as a wave or you can export it as MP3. I think you guys should export it as a wave. They're bigger files, but they're more, you know, that's better quality, right? Yes. So um, I think in our memory lab, we tell people to do export to MP3, but honestly, you guys can do as wave. So then it's gonna, you know, here's my, my wonderful file naming convention <laughs> side A. Uh, it's wave there, okay. Then I hit, oh, and then you can pick where you wanna save it. Um, uh, I guess I'll just do it to the desktop or something. Yeah, and then you hit save, and a window should pop up eventually. Yes, and so this is where you can add some metadata if you want, of like what year, 1999. Um, comments, I'd probably be like, Maggie made this for Siobhan. Some weird question ban. Maybe I'll put that in artist name. <laughs> Random Christian band. All right. Which is like really obnoxious. Okay, there we go. Yeah, and then if I minimize this. Um, so now I, I don't know what it's gonna it's probably gonna open in like Windows Media Player. Uh, groove music. <laughs> yeah. 